for her methods. Quite unusual. To woo a woman by beating up her brothers. Creative. Wonder what else you have up your sleeve. My dear girl, what don't I have up my sleeve? I'd gladly demonstrate. Perhaps behind the barn? Uh, I think you've demonstrated enough. Let's just enjoy ourselves, all right? You don't have all that much time left. Your wish is my command, milady. I'd never deny a maid so fair-featured. Off we go. Ah, my kind of tune. Let's do some dancing. <laughs> In my experience, witches and dancing don't exactly mix. Today they mix like fire and oil, my love. We'll dance the barn down. Faster, faster until we expire. <laughs> Enchanting partner, Shun. Musicians, something lovely for the loving couple. At last, music for our loving embrace. Come, Shani. It's time you discovered my romantic side. Say dance is a mere foretaste of hmm, more intimate interaction. Who says this? I do, for one. I do wonder what you mean by intimate interaction. Oh, it's a fascinating process. One you as a scholar and medic might find especially interesting. I'd gladly explain it in detail, but it's horribly loud in here. See the ladder? Leads to a loft. Surely there we'd not be disturbed while investigating the nature of intimate interaction. Seems the music in the evening draw to a close. You know how a true dancer thanks his lovely partner. Um, not sure I do. Kisses, not to mention the other tricks I perform with my lips. <laughs> yes, we'd best not mention those. Could I talk to Geralt for a moment? What for? He'll have nothing of interest to say. The man's a drip. Please. <sighs> Very well. See how I've reeled her in? Now don't fuck this up. Geralt, 
I'm curious what it's like when that ghost's inside you. Do you feel anything? Have any control? I feel everything. Don't have any control over what I do or say, though. Why do you ask? Because I wonder what it would have been like to dance with you. Just you. Then why don't you? Well, answer me. Thing is, normal folk don't act like Vladimir von Everick. Because they are churls. <laughs> don't be too hard on him. All in all, it was actually rather fun. Ha! <laughs> See that? I'm fun. And you've got a pike so far up your ass, you can't wear hats. Happen to see the man who announced our, your song? Yes, he acted as though he knew me, but we've never met. I'm surprised. Who is he? Gontaro Dim, Master Mirror. Wonder what he's doing here. Then perhaps you should just ask him. Yeah, he didn't show up without a reason. Need to talk to him. Consider that he might have simply been nearby and dropped it on a wing. Promise you this much. He never does anything simply. And certainly not on a whim. Bah! I was to make merry, carouse. Yet here I've stood the last five minutes, listening to you talk. I'm going back in. Ah, better. Come, Shani. The night beckons us not to jabber it away. I beg to differ, madame. You omit the most important ingredient in gingerbread. Time. What sort of balderdash is he feeding them? Quiet. If you listen, you'll learn. Time? What do you mean, time? An ingredient? Time gives the proper consistency. Time provides that ideal crunch on the outside, the delicious moistness within. So how much of this time does it take? That you will not find in any recipe. You must surrender to your senses. Let them lead you so close to time you touch it. Let you sniff it, stroke it over. Time. Time is the key. Greetings, Shani. I must introduce myself. Gaunter Odin. My, what a lovely dress. The color suits you exquisitely. Thanks. I've heard a lot about you, but no one mentioned cooking. Seem to know quite a bit about gingerbread. Quite simply, I know a lot about everything. Is that so? What do you know about me? That you were ever the worst brother, that you envied all gear from your earliest days, and always wished to be just like you. Wait, you can see me? That is, me, Vladimir von Everek? Of course. Why ever wouldn't I? Because I'm in Geralt's body, the Witcher's, and... Just who would I be? If the true nature of things remained hidden from me. Someone like you. Meaning, no one. I wouldn't want to get blood on my damsel's dress. But insult me once more and... You shan't touch me. I know you'd very much like to act like your brother in this situation. Demonstrate how manly you are, but... Let's be honest. Nothing will come of it. You're simply not him, no matter how much you wish you were. 
I came here to revel, enjoy myself, not to discuss my brother. That's good. Olgian probably wouldn't want me to talk to you about him. Olgird was my brother and my friend. Never have there been more loyal comrades than us. The question is, were you as dear to him as he seems to have been to you? He made a hero of me in death. In my last battle, in truth, I was far from valiant. Five came at me. I'll not deny it, I fled. I hid in a cellar, yet they found me, cornered me like a rat. But Olgier told everyone I flew at all five, took them on all at once, alone. I'm rather curious how you know all this. Olgier visits my grave, often, pours a drink for me, gets soused himself, and talks of the old times. He cannot see me, but I hear his every word. Ooh. Well, perhaps one day he'll say something very surprising. What are you getting at? I shan't disturb you any longer. Have a splendid time, for time is... time is short. Shani, I'm sorry, I... It's all right. That was... Oh, forget him. We're here to enjoy ourselves, right? Let's go. The night's still young. Not a word of truth. Don't let it bother. My kid was not just my brother. More importantly, he was my best mate. I believe. Now revel on. Time will wait. If I may, Shani, I'd show you how I cut a jig. Nimble as a leper. Don't let me stop you. By the way you move, what charm, what grace. Thanks. Following some dog's trail? Not exactly how I imagined this wedding. Think I'll wait here. Wonderful, my juicy pair. I shall continue my travails while you rest. Shan't be long now. A spark spitter's cap, if ever I've seen one. As jesterly as they come. Chap must have lost it running from demon. Two conclusions, then. Our magician is fat, and a coward. Missing man, missing mutt. Am I seeing this right? That gammy puss ran up a tree to escape that puppy. Guess so. You, get down. Oh, no. No bloody chance. I value my life. What do we do? Sit. Now that is power. If I'd had that, the Horsons never would have gutted me. Make it do some folly. Roll about on the ground. That sort of sport. No. Oh, could you be any more of a bore? I'll do it myself. 
We're all over. Were I to command it to eat its own tail, it would do so, right? Demon, doghouse, now. Now what have you done? Why ever? Ruin my fun! Have it at the wedding. Climb down. Man-eating beast's gone, as you can see. You sure it won't return? Positive. Better safe than sorry, I always say. Geralt, this jester is drunk as a skunk. I hope he's not polished off that bottle yet. I saved your life, man. Do you not at least owe me a sip? Course. Bottoms up. I say, cracking good mead. Now I understand why you wanted some private time with it. Find me true. But I was fleeing a noun. And but it, it was a monster. A, a furry, faggy devil. They chose a fitting name for it. You can forget about performing in your state. And just what state would that be? Look at yourself, man. You're a tramp, can barely stand, let alone perform. First off, that's bollocks. Second, I'm a fire eater, not a stilt walker. Standing straight ain't a requirement. This may be my only chance to ask. Your fire guzzling trickery, how does it work? Oh, they tossed me out the guild if I told. Except if I took you on as an apprentice. In half a year's time, you'd learn. I haven't half a year. Come, just between you and me. We've drunk together. We're practically brothers. Drank it all yourself. You're no brother of mine. You dare toy with me this way? Very well. Refuse to tell me, and I shall leave you here as a morsel for any passing boars, bears, or bloodthirsty fawns. So choose wisely. This here's a soul. He's suppressing the arts. Out with it. I got, I got a special mixture I drink before every show. After that, I can eat fire, spit fire, do what I please. It don't burn nothing. Is that all? Where's the art in it? Any dribbling imbecile can smear his throat with a protective slurry. Oh, but just about enough of this. First they release the hounds, then come and steal my meat, and now insults. I'm done here. Goodbye. Didn't mean to offend a bloody charlatan. Do something. Listen, I'll give you some more coin and you'll go back to the wedding. Are you daft? This extortionist's already got his due. Take it or leave it. Right. Convince him. Honorless prick. Olgird had it right. All artists are whores. Let's go. Coming or not? I'm coming. I'm coming. To the wedding, then. Perhaps I'll find some more interesting diversions there. Keep calm. Stay close. I shan't stray a step. Wild animals behind every stump in these woods. Tell me, are bears often boar-shaped in your experience? Got weak eyes, see? Besides, I'm a fire eater, not some damn naturalist. Indeed, you are not, Master. Uh, I believe I failed to ask. What do they call you? David Altonsborough. Listen here, Master Hattonsborough. Stay close, and no harm will come to you. I'll see to it your drunken, fire-spitting gob gets to the wedding safe and sound. The missing fire blower is missing no more.
It was my doing, if I may say so myself.